Welcome to the Cabral Concept, where board-certified naturopath and integrative health practitioner Dr. Stephen Cabral shares how he was diagnosed at the age of 17 with a life-altering illness and given no hope for recovery. It was only after studying and traveling all over the world did he discover how to combine ancient Ayurvedic healing practices with state-of-the-art naturopathic and functional medicine to fully rebalance the body and re-energize it with life. It's time to discover how to get well, lose weight, and finally feel alive again. And now, here's your host, Dr. Stephen Cabral. Hi, everyone, and welcome back to this week's Friday Review. Glad to be here with you. Always excited for these Friday Reviews because I get to bring you my favorites of the week. So I've got a book or two to review with you here today, a specific tool that I'm using, an exercise fitness-based tool that I'm currently using to help rehab my left shoulder after an accidental injury that I'll talk about in just a moment. Uh, Of course, I have my updates for what's going on in the private practice and over in the equal life based community and so much more. So as I always like to say, without further ado, let's dive into the show. Let's get in these topics, share with you first, what is going on over at the stephencabral.com website, the equa.life website, all of those different things that we have going on. So for me, and I don't know if it's the same for you, it's just that after a while, if you've been studying health or you've really gotten interested in health, you start to just blend your life with health, meaning like there are things that people do because they have to. So I have to do certain things, right? Like I have to do maybe work things or I have to do certain family things or meetups or whatever it is. But a lot of times when you start to get into health, these are things that you want to do. And then so they become a big part of your life. So for me, you know, when people talk about, well, how do you balance, you know, work and life and these types of things? Honestly, since my I get to do what I do and and I love health and it's such a big part of my life, these things just start to blend together. So when I t- kind of talk about what's going on with stephencabral.com and that website and all these things, that is my on-life extension of essentially how I live my life. So over there, we have all the resources. So there's a brand new tab of the navigation bar because before, only people inside of our little community uh, or <laughs> growing community uh, knew about the resources page. So now it's right there in the navigation bar. If you're unfamiliar with it, you can go to stephencabral.com forward slash resources or just the main website. And now you can click on the little resources tab. There's over a hundred different products that I use in my own life that I'll be talking about on today's show as well. And you know, maybe they'll interest you, maybe they won't. There's probably going to be a couple. And the nice thing is I do them in all different price categories. So there's a little something uh, for everyone, but also a wide variety of interests. So for me, again, like I love health, I love fitness, I love nutritional supplements, I love tech-based gadgets. And so all of that's in there, but of course, always in the field of health, which is essentially the field that I work in. So that's that. We've got um, the resources now up there. And then also we are coming up with the gut and digestion health results accelerator. We've had great, great um, success and so much nice feedback just over the last six weeks since we've launched these health results accelerators. But now you can check out the thyroid health results accelerator, everything that you could want to know about rebalancing your thyroid, like literally A to Z, four plus hours. You don't need to read a dozen books anymore. You don't need to go to a dozen different practitioners. It's all in there. So all the protocols, everything I use in my private practice, how you got there in the first place. Same with female hormones. Estrogen dominance or low estrogen, low progesterone, high androgens like in PCOS, those, those types of particular issues uh, in some women. And then uh, also what about menopause as well? So all of those different phases are covered really inside of a female's life from uh, puberty, getting your cycle, an imbalanced cycle, birth control, uh, menopause, mm-hmm. et cetera. So it's all in there. Again, this is from 20 plus years of practice. Uh, from seeing uh, well over now a quarter million client appointments. So that's all there. And now I'm happy to say uh, by popular demand, meaning like we're allowing now people to kind of upvote what they want to see in their next. We did gut and, excuse me, gut and digestion. So with the gut and digestion module, what we did was essentially look at all of the different phases of digestion, why you might be dealing with acid reflux, bloating, GERD, H. pylori, yeast overgrowth, bacterial overgrowth, 
parasites, um, stress-based bloating, you name it, like constipation, loose stool, anything that could go wrong with your GI tract, we talk about. And with all of the talking about it, we tell you how it happened. And now that you know how it happened, you know how we can also rebalance it. And I give you my protocols. So the nice thing is, it's not just like, hey, try this. It's this, this is why it happened. Now, if you know why it happened, you know how to rebalance your body. So check it out. Remember, for the first week or so, when we open these health results accelerators, they're $100 off, and then the price just goes back to its normal price. So if you want to save $100, just go to stephencabral.com forward slash courses, and you can just click on the gut and digestion one if you'd like, or any of the others. So those will be growing at least uh, one per month. Uh, we'll be moving through those uh, over the next couple months. I love being able to create these and really pass on everything that I've learned over the last 20 years, studying overseas, studying Ayurvedic medicine, traditional Chinese medicine, bioregulatory medicine, orthomolecular medicine, you name it, all of these different great forms of medicine. How do we use all of those together for a truly integrative health practice approach? And that's exactly what we do. So I just one last thing I always say, like, there's no theory. So this is direct from private practice. So you know you're getting protocols that work for real people, not just in a book or in a research study. Like, this actually works in the real world. So that's something I love to be able to bring you as well, like the real things that really work, right? Guaranteed. Okay, the next thing going on right now over at Equal Life, inside of our Equal Life community, with it being Valentine's Day season, I guess. And, you know, I'm not a Hallmark holiday kind of guy, but it is a fun holiday. Uh, I have three girls in my life. Uh, plus, plus, I can't forget my mom as well. And uh, so I want to share with you this, that I know what Valentine's Day is coming up, what, just in two days or so from now. So you probably saw the offer as of uh, this week, but we are bundling. This was a very popular uh, thing that we did last year. So we're bundling our chocolate daily nutritional support. So those nice daily nutritional, nutritional support shakes, uh, which give you all your vitamins, all your minerals, your electrolytes, your antioxidants, your daily detox factors, and 15 grams of a plant-based vegan protein. So we're bundling that with the advanced collagen support. So then you get all of the hair, the skin, the nail-based anti-aging benefits from the number one collagen product in the world. That is with three patent ingredients. You won't find it really. I mean, that this is it. Like that, It's the highest level product out there. So Advanced collagen support uh, bundled with the month supply of the daily nutritional support for just $99. That's a $40 savings, and that is going on uh, while supplies last over at Equa.com. Life. So whether you want to buy yourself a Valentine's Day gift or someone else, of course, you can add that to the list. And again, that's at uh, equa.life. That's E-Q-U-I dot L-I-F-E. All right, let's move on now to our first product review of the week. Actually, I'm glad I have a couple bullets here. I always want to share with you the recap for the week from the podcast. So this is important because Motivation, our motivation and mindset Monday. We went over one of my favorite quotes by Arthur Ashe, and it's really talking about why you have to, at some point, banish your excuses. And I teach you how to do that in a much gentler and easier way. That's episode 1830 this week. Episode 1831 was these six plant flavonoids that extend life, even if you're not perfect with your diet, even if you're not exercising as much as you should be. Uh, believe it or not, in studies, it even showed if you're smoking or drinking uh, more than you should, uh, which is any smoking is more than you should. So check out that show. Uh, honestly, it's so easy to implement into your life. And I give you, of course, real world actionable steps. Uh, on Wednesday, 1832, episode 1832, all of these, of course, can be found at stephencabral.com forward slash podcast. We went over the 10 keystone actions to get into amazing shape, meaning like these are the 10 things that are not really optional if you want to get in great shape and maintain being in good shape. So check that out. Yesterday, we had on uh, my podcast mentor for many years ago go. Obviously, uh, John Lee Dumas and I are still friends to this day. I don't know if that's obvious or not, uh, but we are. He's, he's really a great guy, and uh, he has an amazing podcast still to this day, uh, EO Fire, and um, he helped me out when I was looking to say, I want to take my practice, what I do, what I know works, and I want to share that with the world for free. And I want to do it every single day. And uh, and John was one of the only people that I know who actually did a daily podcast as well. And so what I did was I hired him uh, and, and essentially did his course, which I will link up today. So I'll give you the exact course I did. It's still going on to this day. That's uh, everything. All the show notes today will be at stephencabral.com forward slash 1834. All right? stephencabral.com 
youtube.com forward slash 1834. I'll link up that as well. But you can check out yesterday's podcast uh, with John Lee Dumas. And uh, we're even talking about a brand new book he has coming out for entrepreneurs. All right. Today's show is today's show. We're going through the best of. So let's get into it right now. The product review that I wanted to share with you this week before we get to our book review is this little item right here. And I wouldn't say that it's little, it's about two feet long and it's made of hard hard plastic and it's called a Thera cane. Now I've got a bunch of different little massage tools that kind of look like this, but this one is old school. I know it's been around a long time and it's the one that I keep going back to. Believe it or not, uh, I have one at my house and I have one at my office. And once you start to use it, you'll know why. Uh, You don't want to travel around necessarily walking around with this thing, although it's not that hard to travel with. Uh, If you're not watching this on video, you can go to stevencabral.com forward slash 1834. But basically, it looks like a cane. It's about a two-foot cane. It's uh, shaped like a J with a little knob at the end. And then there's a couple extra little knobs across the side that you can use. And I'm going to show you just a quick example on video of how I use it. But also, I'm going to link up the exact super spinatus uh, theracane we'll call it maneuver I do in order to open up my shoulder. And I'll talk about the injury in just a moment. But what I'm going to do is show you that you can hold these handles right here on the right side of it. And you can put that J loop right around to the back. And with the knob at the end of this, you can actually massage in and around the shoulder blade. I'm telling you right now, you'll find tight spots. We call those trigger points. And you'll hold it right there for at least 30 seconds, just doing slow movements around or just putting direct pressure. This is how you can give yourself a good quality massage without even having to meet a massage therapist every week or so. Although I do recommend massage therapy, there's no doubt about it. But This Theracane for about $29 uh, is a nice substitute in between sessions. I've gotten tremendous benefit out of it. Uh, Believe it or not, my mom uh, uses it. We've used these before uh, when I had my uh, fitness, health and fitness nutrition studio as well. So it's a great tool. It's inexpensive. And it comes with uh, a little booklet here as well. This is kind of no frills. I feel like it's a no frills uh, overall company. And that doesn't mean it's a bad thing, meaning like it does exactly what it's supposed to do. And it shows you all the different stress. I don't use this because I've been using this for a few years, Uh, but you can see this one right here that it it shows you seated ones and how to massage different parts of your body. So, you know, it's a great, great tool to use. Honestly, um, why did I pick it up? Like, why did I start getting back into it? Because I haven't been using it for a while. I injured my supraspinatus. And and I want to tell you a little bit about it just because I always want you to know uh, when you know, when I'm going through some hardships as well, and I wouldn't, and we wouldn't consider this a hardship considering what many people um, have to go through and what I've gone through in my own life as well. But I've been fortunate not to really have a lot of injuries. Uh, I'm not going to knock on wood, but I'll virtually knock on wood. How's that? So, you know, I I was obviously sick for a very large period of time, but right before that, I had a lot going on. It's one of the reasons why I did get sick. And one of those injuries was I tore my Achilles, I tore my Achilles my Achilles tendon. And I tore it on my senior year of high school, the very beginning of my senior year in high school. And, uh, and it was only a couple months later that I got uh, very sick. And it wasn't because of the torn Achilles. But of course, that provided a lot of stress because uh, my sports career was done. It wasn't like I was going to go on to play collegiate sports. Uh, but I enjoyed sports in high school. And I did okay at them. And, and it was very much a, a camaraderie thing for me. And so I was very disappointed not to be able to do that anymore. But anyway, I tore my Achilles, uh, and then I wasn't injured really again until uh, maybe at 22 or so. And then I hurt my, I herniated. Actually, in 20 years old, around there, I uh, pinched a nerve in my neck. Not again. Any of these things weren't doing anything major. Pinched a nerve in my neck, just literally warming up when I was going to the gym. I turned my head to the side while doing an incline bench press, uh, and then I just pinched a nerve. It was quite random. Uh, but again, that that fixed pretty quickly. I did herniate a disc in my lower back, uh, again, with nothing major, just bending over in a gym to pick up a weight. But I was literally just racking a weight. I wasn't doing anything crazy. Hurt my lower back. But then just a little bit later, uh, I don't know if it was fortuitous or not, uh, I ended up getting certified through through the National Academy of Sports Medicine. And I started to learn about postural analysis at a a fairly young age, which was great. And uh, I learned about um, compensation in the body, and and I was certainly compensating in many different ways. So if you ever have the opportunity to work with a uh, functional range conditioning specialist or a National Academy of Sports Medicine personal trainer, uh, it it could do your world of good. 
so then from that point on, I, I wasn't injured uh, for a long time. About three years ago, though, I actually injured the nerve uh, up near my elbow, the ulnar nerve. I had ulnar nerve entrapments. Uh, it's a lot like carpal tunnel, but on the upper arm. And I lost really... It was numb, and it would almost like you got hit in your humerus, right? Your funny bone. That's what it felt like almost all the time. It was a, it was just nagging. I want to say it's not debilitating, but I lost strength in it. I couldn't use it. I couldn't extend it. Uh, it was quite miserable. But again, these are things that you can learn from. So I had never heard of anyone with ulnar nerve entrapment. I never had it myself. So I reach out to other experts and I say, hey, uh, and this was a chiropractor friend of mine. I said, hey, what do you know about this? And he said, oh, it sounds like ulnar nerve entrapment. I said, oh, okay. Now uh, showed me the different rehab exercises to do for it. I immobilized it while sleeping because I was making it worse every night by keeping it bent. And about six weeks later, it was all healed. So that was really great. So that's why, again, it's always good to reach out to the people that have those answers. Now, I got injured uh, just about two months ago, three months ago. I've been dealing with this uh, and it is a... Uh, it's a painful one. It really is. So I have uh, a s small tear in my labrum on my shoulder, but not enough, nothing, nothing to say I'm ever going to do surgery and like that. I'm not saying that at all because I'm not. Uh, but uh, I also have supraspinatus tendonitis, something I've had previously in the past. Now I got it because during the uh, pandemic from about April all the way through, let's say September, uh, I moved to Maine and I had the opportunity to then be we'll call it the country. And I got into archery at the very same time. So I was pulling a bow as kind of like my, my new hobby, which I loved and my daughters enjoyed it. So it was like just great time to hang out, be able to pull a bow. And I was doing that. And I was shooting that bow like 50 times, like pulling that back like 50 times a day. And then I, I just overdid it. That's it. Like I loved doing it and, and still do, but I'm taking a little time off. Uh, and I overdid it. And so it got tight. I got this tendonitis uh, in my supraspinatus. I also wasn't doing enough massage with it. I was doing tons of dips, tons of pull-ups, uh, tons of push-ups. All these things are also tightened up internal rotation of the shoulder. To make a long story short, it was fine. It wasn't a big deal. But then what happened was it's always these strange accidents. I just overextended my arm, reaching over a fence to literally grab a Frisbee that my daughter threw. And it um, it didn't dislocate it. It didn't sublux it, but it overstretched it because I had so much tightness in there. And then all of a sudden now I have this... this uh, painful tendonitis. So I'm using this Theracane to work it out from the back. And then I'm using the underside of it through my armpit. And if anybody, any fitness people out there, they know what I'm talking about, chiropractors, et cetera. And it's working tremendously well. Just two weeks of doing this, I feel like I'm already 60% better. So my goal is within the next four weeks to have it completely gone and then go back to pulling that bow again. So that's that. You can check it out. I'm going to link up the video by um, someone else that uh, shows exactly how to do this because I don't need to reinvent the wheel. They've already done it. So check it out. A great product. Uh, of course, um, again, inexpensive and uh, it will certainly uh, pay for itself. All right. Book review of the week. Book review of the week is The Molecule of More. And let me, let me just say one more thing because I don't want to end with you know, what, what I just said there about the Theracane and the injuries, keep in mind, it's just, you have to, keep, I haven't done anything to get injured, you know, on purpose or anything like that. And, and no, like major, there's like never been a lifting accident like that. I'll tell you though, sometimes I just want to say like injuries happen, like things in life happen. So I just want to share with you, you can't always control everything that happens to you in your life. Sometimes it's actually for you. You can learn from it. You can get better. You can make adjustments. So I always look at these things as like, I don't think I could have done anything really different. I'm learning from it. Uh, and honestly, these are temporary. It'll be gone now uh, in a couple of weeks. So I just wanted to share that with you. All right. On to our book review of the week. This week's book, now I read a bunch of books last week, but this one stood out. It's called A Molecule of More, How a Single Chemical in Your Brain Drives Love, Sex, and Creativity, and Will Determine the Fate of the Human Race. Uh, this is by Dr. Uh, Lieberman and Michael Long. So I picked up this book. I don't even know how I heard about it. It could have been from um, Andrew Huberman, but I'm not positive. But I want to give you just a little taste of it because it's a really nice book. I'm gonna. It's all about dopamine, essentially. And I'm going to link up my podcast today on dopamine so you can learn more about it on audio. And then if it interests you, maybe you'll want to check out this book. Uh, this is a nice little summary. The down chemicals was 
then called the here and nows, and allows you to enjoy what's in front of you. They enable you to savor and enjoy, or perhaps to fight or run away right now. The up chemical is different. That's what we're talking about in this book. The up chemical, it makes you desire what you don't have yet. It drives you to seek new things. It rewards you when you obey it, and it makes you suffer when you don't. It is the source of creativity and, further along the spectrum, madness. It is the key to addiction and the path to recovery. It is the bit of biology that makes an ambitious executive sacrifice everything in pursuit of success, that makes successful actors and entrepreneurs and artists keep working long after they have all the money and the fame they've ever dreamed of, and that makes a satisfied husband or wife risk everything for the thrill of someone else. It is the source of the undeniable itch that drives scientists to find explanations and philosophers to find reason, order, and meaning. It is why we look into the sky for redemption and God. It is why heaven is above and earth is below. It is the fuel for the motor of the dreams. It is the source of our despair when we fail. It is why we seek and, uh, we seek and succeed. It is why we discover and prosper. It is also why we are never happy for very long. So really, it's an interesting book, and it talks about uh, the molecule dopamine, the neurotransmitter, I should say, dopamine. And I've been studying dopamine for some time. I read a book many years ago uh, about addiction, and I can try to link that up as well. And it was all about, this was mainly on alcohol, but it was on drugs as well and alcohol, and really the, the drive for dopamine. And so this book tells you that dopamine is essential to not be depressed, to not be too low, and to have ambition, and to have drive, and to really seek out that next level in life. But of course, taken too far uh, can lead to the feelings of domination and, and uh, you know wanting to dominate things and take control. And so it's a nice balance and, uh, and a great book. So I enjoy reading it. It's very short. It's like 180 pages. There's a lot of research throughout the book, but no more than 200 pages total. I think this is like a great size for a book. I've got a couple more books uh, in my brain that I want to put on paper. And um, they're always so much bigger than 200 pages, but I like this size and, and I really want to move towards this size in the future. Very, very consumable. Uh, you can absolutely take this down in just a couple weeks total. So the Molecule More, I'm going to link that up if the Molecule Dopamine interests you. We'll definitely check that out. Now, if you've never heard about it, I will link up a podcast today on dopamine as well. All right, that's our book review. I want to give you two research studies before we go today. I know I'm close to my time, uh, but these are two interesting ones that I would thought I would bring to you. The first one is uh, on antibiotics and our food. So you know that this is something that we've chatted about before, and it's really why there's so many issues with the gut microbiome. Right now, uh, science is finding that there's about 81 different antibiotics in our food and in our soil, and that is actually mainly in milk, uh, it's in eggs, and it is in meat. But it's also being found on produce, you know, our grains and our veggies and our fruit. And the reason is that it can be in the soil as well. And that's because the manures coming from these animals, like cows, which mainly, that have been fed antibiotics. So, you know, here's the issue is that I am one for kind of uh, trusting and proof and labeling. So I, I trust my local farmers. I do. I, I know the work that they're doing. I know how hard they work. And, and I like to see that. But in, when you go to a grocery food store and you're just picking up conventional meat, you have no idea what's in that. Honestly, like no idea what's in that. It could be from a thousand different cows that, cows that have been mixed together for the Hamburg. That's the honest truth. That's where it comes from. And so you just don't know. So what now, and, and it's almost impossible to detect all these antibiotics. Now, why is this even a big deal? Well, the antibiotics end up going into your digestive system. And antibiotics can destroy and imbalance your own gut microbiome, which, by the way, is 80% really of our own health and absorption of nutrients and immune system. So a new solution is being developed, and I don't mean just solution solution. They're able to take just microparticles of the meat or whatever the food is, dissolve it in a solution, and actually see which, if any, of these antibiotics have been detected. And they did six foods already, and believe it or not, in all of those uh, six foods, antibiotics uh, were isolated. So I just want to just to just to push you in that path that you really want to, if you can, grass-fed beef, 
pastured eggs, pastured chicken, wild uh, based fish, that you're getting organic based produce and that you are washing that produce as well. So that's my, that's my goal for you is to really think about where your food is coming from. And I think very shortly, this uh, type of labeling will be on labels. Like you'll be able to use a QR code or a scanner and actually see that this is antibiotic free. So I look for that day. Um, great research. I'm going to send that over to you using this uh, mass spectrometry uh, method as well. All right, new research as well. Uh, this is more of an interesting one. Like I found this really interesting. I don't know if you will, but neuroscientists isolate promising mini antibodies against this particular virus, meaning the pandemic, from a llama. So this is researchers have isolated a set of promising tiny antibodies or nanobodies uh, against SARS-CoV-2 that were produced by a llama named Cormac. Preliminary results suggest that at least one of these nanobodies called NIH CoVNB112 could prevent infections and detect virus particles by grabbing hold of SARS-CoV-2 spike proteins. In addition, the nanobody appeared to work equally well in either liquid or aerosol form, suggesting it could remain effective after inhalation. You know, this is why I think, and that's why I'm always, my mind's always open to like modern day solutions as well, because I, I am I'm still a believer that if we can use plasma-based antibodies to naturally be able to ha be basically, this is what we do. So when you get this particular virus, and I'll probably be talking about this next week, your body builds up antibodies. Now that that's the best uh, that's the best solution that you could possibly have is to have the antibodies in your body. Like that's the truth. Like that's why people want vaccines. That's why all these things are being developed because you want the antibodies. Like that's what you want. Well, what if you could take the antibodies bodies, you're literally borrowing them from another human or in this case, a llama, and they are able to be brought into your body. And now if your body comes in contact with this particular virus, you won't get it. Because your body will see the virus, it will stop it before it begins to replicate at a larger degree. So that's the goal for all of us. Now, more studies obviously need to be done because we want to make sure that there's no cross-reactivity in the immune system with the antibodies from a llama or something else. So, uh, and I keep saying llama, that's like my Boston accent is llama. Uh, so what I will do is I'll link the study up here today, but here's the thing. I'm always going to keep you updated on the latest and greatest. And this is a reality. Like this is actually going to happen, this plasma antibody therapy. So now it's really just being worked out. And I want you to know that. So I'm going to keep you updated, of course, uh, on these Friday reviews. That is it for our show today. Thank you so much for tuning in. You know that each and every weekend we do our Cabral house calls. So please do stay tuned for those tomorrow tomorrow. Take care and enjoy your weekend. Thanks so much for joining me here today on the Cabral Concept Podcast. Real pleasure to be able to speak with you on our daily show. What I want to do right now is share with you the listener only and community only offer that we have going on over at Equal Life right now. It is a timely offer for Valentine's Day where we are bundling our best selling daily nutritional support shake in chocolate along with our advanced collagen support. The reason why that this this is a great deal is because we are taking $40 off those two daily new nutritional support shakes combined with the advanced collagen. So you are getting all three of those for $99 and that is going to save you $40 while supplies last this week only two chocolate daily nutritional support combined with an advanced collagen support and industry two industry leading products for just $99. Check it out while supplies last over at equa.life. That is E-Q-U-I dot L-I-F-E. Take care, everyone. Have an amazing rest of the day.